Happy St. Patrick's Day! We are at Disney Springs to celebrate, and of course you know where, but to find out, you gotta come along! It's based off our name. Now when you're at Disney, there are so many different places you can celebrate St. Patrick's Day, but I really wanted to come to Disney Springs to celebrate at Raglan Road, which is like the Irish pub here. And right here on the patio stage, there's already some Irish music going on. Look at all the green. Oh, this is gonna be a fantastic day. I had to escape the music a little bit. It was getting rowdy already, and I wanted to be able to tell you guys a little bit about this amazing event. In order to be a part of the block party, you do have to purchase a little Raglan Road wristband. Of course it's green. It is $20 a pop, and that basically gets you into the facility of Raglan Road to enjoy the block party, of course, the outside stage with all the music and fun that's going on. But this does not guarantee you seats in Raglan Road to eat. We did put our name in. It said three hours, but we're gonna wait or we're gonna try to find a walk-up bar stool table and maybe grab some fun Irish food there. And yes, there is quite a queue to get in here to Raglan Road, even some setup lines. But if you have the wristband like I do, you can walk through the, the tree, the Irish bushes into the world of wonder. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it's a very special walkway. And I think they were able to grab us a little walk up table. But before we head inside, we have to get some St. Patty's Day props. Thank you so much. We got a little Guinness koozie to start, some beads. Oh my gosh, all the things. And you gotta love that. Peace, love, and St. Patty's. Get it guys? Peace, love, and positivity. Peace, love, and patties. We're beat it up, let's head inside. Call this festival the Mighty Festival. It's pretty much all week long here at Raglan Road. And we already had a little amazing performance by these Irish dancers, and now they're passing out some stickers. And we were so lucky to grab a table. And by we, my Irish drinking buddies are here. Travis is already drinking. <laughs> And of course, Jackie, super enthused. Happy St. Patrick's Day! Happy St. Patrick's Day. You are like super enthusiastic and green today. You are green everywhere. I love it. The socks it. too. The socks too? That's legit. <laughs> oh, here we came with the bagpipes. Some music for to play. That's how they show their respect for Patty Murphy. That's how they show their honor and their pride. They said it was a sin and shame. I went it one another. On every drink in the... Of course, I had to get my snake bite, which is beer and cider mixed. I love it so much. It's Jackie's. Is this your first one? I think so. And I didn't think I'd like it. Actually, they have these at Renaissance Festival sometimes. Yes, I And do. I never want to try it, but now I like it. So. Yeah, it's really good. Huzzah. Happy St. Patty's. Huzzah. Happy St. Patty's and Huzzah. already demolished this board of beauty that's literally what it's called a board of beauty and this is what I'm really excited to dive into they call it an Irish egg it is sometimes can be known as a scotch egg but since it's st. Patty's and we're close together they're what they're pretty close together so yeah they are <laughs> pretty dang close but since it's st. Patty's Day we're gonna call it an Irish egg and let's take a look inside here Usually the inside of scotch eggs are very, very cool. And oh my goodness. Wow. I think that's perfectly cooked. You don't want it too runny. Uh, you want it just, you gotta be yoking me. You want a little yolk. Little bit of everything. Same with that. 
It's so good. The food is so good, it's making us do a jig. All right, we have another drinking buddy to add to the gang. Happy St. Patty's Day, Nate. Happy St. Patrick's Day. He's already finished his beer, but it's okay because he got something else. What are these? Scallops on the floor. Scallops on the floor. Wow, those are so crazy. It's a dingle hopper. It's a dingle hopper. I, I guess like that. All right, dig it. Dig it. Dig it. Can you eat the whole thing? <laughs> it's really good. The scallop kind of plopped out, but it basically tastes like really fancy fish and chips. Yeah, fancy fish and chips on a fork. I love it. festival booklet here. This basically shows you what the entire week holds. Thursday through Sunday, all the different bands and dancers and things that are gonna be happening. You can still come Saturday and Sunday. It's still going on. Well, what a super festive meal. What did you think about your drinks and your meal, babe? I thought it was good. I liked that there was like a variety. I mean, I guess we got the board, so. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I thought it was a good amount of food for, for what it was, and you got to try every little, every little thing in there. It was like exactly. four different things. But, and yeah. what Travis was saying is if you're not into like shepherd's pie, fish and chips like they do have burgers they do have some simple foods as well but all the Irish classics are absolutely amazing and what's really great with the wristband we can kind of come and go as we please you can walk inside Rackland Road you can try to get a table it's first come first serve but you can just walk up to the bar and get a beer also but now we're gonna hang outside for a little bit see the performers that are on the outside stage and just continue on with the amazing St. Patty's Day. They're playing some fast music here out on the stage. And then right over here, they actually have some complimentary face training. How much fun. And these are all the options you can get for face painting. Wow, there's some really intense ones. So maybe we'll wait in line and see if we can get one a little bit later. check out the beautiful Raglan Road store here. They even have some specialty St. Patrick's Day Raglan Road merch you can get in here, as well as a full-size sheep. Can we get a full-size sheep, Trav? Yeah. Why not? We already have a full-size dog. We, we can get the sheep, sheep to come home with us also, as well as some beautiful Irish handmade jewelry. Check this out, all this original leather. This is really cool. This is the Raglan Road, the life and soul of Ireland. So it's literally the tunes and the songs that they play live from the restaurant every day. That's really, really fun. You can even get it on Amazon Music and on Spotify in case you want to listen at home. And check out this, you can fully be pinch proof on St. Patty's. They have all the green things you need, including green mustaches, tattoos, and don't forget your Irish bobble hats. <laughs> oh yeah. This is, a full, this is a full moment. This is a, a core memory. A core memory. And the Clotta ring right over here is another timeless piece of Irish design in the Clotta's crown, heart and hands. And just so you know, the Clotta is a romantic symbol that expresses love of loyalty and friendship. I remember the first time my dad actually gave me my very first Clotta ring as my promise ring. It is very, very special to see them here in Raglan Road. For only $6.99, you can take a piece of Ireland home with you. Look how beautiful this is. It's an actual shamrock 
and these little things, they have like different ones you can choose from. It's beautiful. We just walked out with I think our last beer of St. Patty's. Because look at this thing. It's the size of my head. It's also another snake bite, but it's a 32 ounce snake bite. I know, I know. Let me see it against your head. Let me see. <laughs> it's bigger than your head. All right, we are exiting the Irish bushes out on the Disney Springs walkway. And that's because even if you don't want to pay $20 to be a part of the block party on St. Patrick's Day, there are tons of places around Disney Springs that you can go get a St. Patrick's Day snack. I think we decided on a snack and it's at Swirls on the Water. And before it melts, let's show it off, Jackie. Look there at her. It is. She's showing I'm her St. Patrick's Day beaut here. What is this? The shamrock cone. It's half mint ice cream and half chocolate ice cream. And it's got little shamrocks and green sparkles on it. I think it's really cute. It is so cute. And it's not completely melting yet. It's it's getting there. It's starting. <laughs> but still like All right, a little, little bit, bit of the mint, a right? little bit of the chocolate, yeah. and it's already no dripping everywhere. Like there are the inspected. Like That's what she said. <laughs> And I just noticed, look how cool. They have some green cotton candy out here. You gotta love that, showing the spirit. Do you guys wanna go back to the party? Back to the block? Back to the block. Let's go. We made it back to the outside bar and we are gonna do some Irish slammers. Do we just pour it or what do we do? Drop it. Drop it. Three, two, one, drop. Happy St. Patty's! The busyness has not stopped here at the Mighty Festival. It is definitely mighty, it is definitely fun, and for sure a memorable, memorable event. Closing out the night here at Raglan by going on the big Disney Springs balloon. Look at that. Above the clouds. Man, that would be a very, very lucky night. We came, we saw, we conquered, we Irish. <laughs> it was such a fun time. This was not your first Raglan Road party. It wasn't my first Raglan Rodeo. <laughs> It definitely was mine, but make sure you guys go and check out Jackie's video. I'm sure you're gonna see a totally different POV of the day. It was the best day ever. It was, it was so fun. All right, we're leaving. We're leaving the special bushes, the magical bushes, for the last time. Well, you guys, thanks so much for coming along on this Disney Springs adventure. I really have not spent so much time here at Disney Springs, and I think it's really fun on the holidays to do so because every shop every restaurant is celebrating just how we are make sure you check out all my friends povs in the description of the day it really was the best day ever i think the 20 dollars cover to get in the little gated area was worth it it made it a little bit more personable a little bit more private to get your harp and your ciders and your beers it was such a fun St. Patrick's Day. But for now, peace, love, and positivity, and all the good things. Love you guys. Bye.